hello everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how you can set up epson sure color p9 917 inch photo printer to your computer wirelessly so to do that you need to uh, initially set up the printer if this is a brand new printer you can follow the instruction in the installation guide that came with the printer so this is how the installation guide will look like you can unpack your printer then you can go ahead and uh, open the uh, like ink cartridges install it you can turn on your printer and do the initial setup of your printer using the printer control panel now this is a wireless printer so you can uh, connect your printer uh, to any of your computer or a cell phone devices uh, wirelessly uh, to set up the printer on your computer wirelessly you need to visit uh, epson.com to download the software so once you go to the epson.com you need to select your country and uh, then you can click on the support tab at the top right corner to download the driver once i click on the support page uh, we'll get to the printer icon we need to click on the printer because we are setting up the printer and then that's where we need to type the name of the product that we are setting it up so i'm going to type it here it's a sure color p900 and i'll type that and i'll see the printer in the list i'll click on that and then it will find the driver for us so we need to click on the downloads because we are downloading the software and now we need to choose the operating system as per your computer so in case if you have windows 11 like most of the people have windows 11 nowadays so uh, if you have windows 11 you can choose that one or if you have windows 10 you can pick uh, windows 10 uh, or if you have a Mac computer you can scroll down and you can find uh, your Mac operating system version and you can also scroll down to find if there is any other device okay so you can uh, pick your operating system in my case I'm going to choose Windows 10 I'll click on go once I'll go there uh, once I'll click on there I'll find the driver so I need to click on that one first link because that's where I'll find all the driver package I just need to install this one I don't need to install each of these because this one has uh, all the uh, package of the driver and the software so I'll click on download it will start downloading at the top right corner there is a down arrow at the top right corner in your browser if you have microsoft edge or a firefox you will see the download uh, arrow at the top right corner so once the file is downloaded you need to double click on that uh, downloaded file and run the setup it will give you instruction step by step to set up your printer to uh, any of your computer and if you have a, like a cell phone that you want to set it up with uh, for example if you have an android phone you can download the ios app when you click on it it will uh, show you the which application you need to install you need to install epson smart panel that's what you need to type in the app store search box and if you have like an android phone you need to type uh, go ahead and open the google play store and look for the same application so once you install this application you'll be able to use the printer and the scanner of this printer uh, using your cell phone so that's it if you have any problem uh, using the printer or setting it up to your devices you can type uh, your question or queries in the comment box below and i'll reply there i'll also put the link of the driver and the installation guide and the user guide in the video description so you can find it there thank you so much for watching you have a nice day